Alrighty, and we're back with the K1 World Grand Prix 2018 Japan. K Festa 1. Here at the Saitama Super Arena in the main arena configuration, we've got 15,000 screaming fans getting ready for this welterweight title belt here in the red. The defending champion, Yuta Kubo, taking on in the blue, Melsik Batazarian. I'm going to kick things off here. I'm Brian. And I'm Phil. Let's see what happens no! in the ring tonight. <clears throat> Fighting for the for the welterweight belt. Mm. Now held by Kubo and Batasarian. Looking to put it around his waist. Real interesting matchup here. We've got Melsik, who competed in the 2017 welterweight tournament um, and was picked to be a possible Winner of the whole thing. However, after his first fight, unfortunately, dislocated his shoulder. Ah. Couldn't continue. So they've lined him up here with a title match with the champion, Kubo. Mm. Dislocating a shoulder is uh, not pleasant. Mm. Hard, to, hard to come back from, too. You know, it happens once, and then it's, it can kind of easily start happening again yeah. if you don't go through proper, proper um, rehab measures. Yeah. Kickboxing is a great way to rehab uh, mm -hmm. some injuries, so who knows? Hopefully, uh, yeah, and uh, Kubo here, a great champion, tons of experience, and uh, a real Oof. tactician who's, uh, yeah, just had, had a lot of fights um, and a crafty southpaw. Great with his counter strikes as well. He has some hard, hard hits going on here. That's very Milsic. Looks like more of a power puncher type fighter. Mm. So both guys with with explosive KO power. Um, be interesting to see how this plays out here. Yeah, south poor south poor matchup. That's right. Well, in real real equal stats, both 175 uh, centimeters. Looks like a little bit younger. Um, the big difference is Kubo's experience. Melsic mm. with nine wins and only one loss. Where Kubo, as you said, 46 wins. Mm. Only 10 defeats and two draws. So mm. Quite a disparity there. Experience, possibly. Um, yeah, yeah, and uh, Kubo just really well versed in the kickboxing rule set. He kicks well, he punches well, he counters well. Um, he's got to be careful there for uh, Badasarian's um, big left hand. Interesting, too, you see both, both guys southpaws here. Yeah, uh, somewhat of a rarity for southpaws, mm. right? To, Match up with other South Boys, but they're quite a bit in in in, in this uh, K1 organization. Mm. Uh, you do you do see you do see quite a few South Boys, especially compared to say fighters in the U.S. Yeah, which, you know, maybe it's quite rare to find a South Boy. Um, yeah, not such an eventful first round there. Mm. Uh, both fighters putting each other out. Mm. Punches thrown. But yeah, some big shots from both. I think, you know, what stands out to me there was uh, Kubo landed some good stiff leg kicks. Mm -hmm. um, I think he yeah. chopping at the legs. It's going to take away some of that leverage yeah. on Vadasarian's yeah. big, big punches. Ozik uh, Vadasarian fighting from uh, uh, what country? Um, Armenia. Yeah, this could be right. Yep, Armenia. Yep, that's right. Known for known for their tough fighters, man. Yeah. Yeah, bought a bought a Sarian here physically. So real strong Oof. and really steps in real powerful. But he's just gotta be careful a crafty guy like Kubo mm -hmm. um, is really good with his counters. Good kicks by uh, Kubo. You can see great distance control yeah. as well. Just floating on the outside. 
That's the thing. It's just gotta be, gotta be Ooh, careful. Interesting. Stepping in there, <laughs> sweeping the legs out. Interesting exchange there. Music. In the corner, one, two. It's a uh, bit, yeah, bit of a stalemate here. Neither guy landing anything super clean, mm. besides Kubo having some good, good low kicks. Yeah. Oof! Yeah, big, big left hand there, just kind of bouncing off the shoulder. And good chopping low kick. Music. Now I know how he dislocated his shoulder. Jeez, with punches <laughs> like that. Yeah. Yeah, Jeez. big, big power, man. Real aggressive, real strong. Real and, and he might be well served to just blast on right ahead and get in Kubo's face and not give him any time to set up a counter. Yeah. Ooh, there you go. Yeah, that, that's the energy he has to maintain. He just drops the hammer on that left hand, man. Just clubbing strike. Well, even though, look at Kubo's shoulder. Yeah, right it's shoulder now. bright red. Yeah. Even though um, it's not hitting his chin, He's got to absorb that. Yeah. That's going to slow his punches down and it's uncomfortable. Make him, make him jumpy. Oh, yeah, both guys doing a little bit too much holding. The ref is not a big fan of that. Nope. Ooh, nice. Nice left there. But met Kubo's guard, but as you said, absorbing this Ooh, upper. Go well, back to the low kick. That's what he's got to stick with. Yeah. Great weapon there. Looks like not checking it, pulling back there at the end, but he should not let any of those land for free. Oof. I think Kubo, well, you're right. Kubo can maintain those low kicks. Mm. You always say it pays dividends. Later on, yeah. they're on the fight. Yeah. And the Japanese fighters are just always such great low kickers. The kicks are snappy and they're fast and they're hard. His shoulder is bright red, man. <laughs> yeah. You might have might have a cut developing there. <laughs> shoulder. Yeah, first shoulder cut. Uh. <laughs> yes. <laughs> but I think I think Melsic is, is hoping to dislocate Kubo's shoulder yeah. <laughs> here. Then. Jeez. Okay, a little front kick on the inside. Is just a little bit wild. Mm -hmm. um, you need to be careful with that. Well, great with the distance, hanging back. Um, he's being smart, too. Yeah. Good fight. Bit of, bit of a, bit of another kind of stalemate there in yeah. that round. No one really breaking away. I, I like the work that Kubo is doing to the legs. He's got to break away with it, though, or make yeah. something happen yeah. with it. And, you know, Melsic smashing home with the punch is not landing cleanly, but my gosh, yeah, the, the damage, damage is to real. his shoulder yeah. is... Some of the worst I've seen. Yeah, that, yeah, that one right there. <laughs> Bright red, man. Clubbing him. Yeah, he puts, mm. puts everything into that shot. Real powerful, real explosive. Interesting to see what Kubo decides to do here. You know, he's definitely not going to want to give up this title. No, um, definitely not. He needs to come out with, with uh, some sort of game plan here. I'm, I personally, I like the low kick. And as soon as, uh, if Melsic starts showing some damage, then he can open up to mm. different moves and yep. think the low kick. Or, yeah, yeah Mel Melsic not really checking the kick, and that's it. That's the middle one right in there. Spin back, back fist. Ooh, back to the, yeah, the low kick, there he goes. Yep, there you go. In the, Ooh, in the inside. Coming back with Working the that Ooh, Ooh, nice guys. kick by Melsic. Right? Mm. Mixing it up, yeah, I yeah. didn't expect that one. Ooh, nice, nice punch, but uh, Kubo rolled with it. Kubo just got happy. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Kubo, one of those 46 wins of experience. That's uh, right, yeah. <laughs> Pushing away and then uh, putting a little icing on the cake. Yeah, you can see the leg, leg is reddening up there for Melsic. And Ooh. I can tell you that those leg kicks don't feel good. No. Ooh, just not. Bring up the leg, up the man. Leg up to defend. Getting out of the way there. That's good, yeah. If he's gonna eat it, um, he needs to come back with something. Yeah. Make him pay for it. Yeah. No, don't, don't give him any freebies. He can uncork the left hand. And he's kind of just letting himself eat it. Yeah. That leg, leg's a little wobbly too. Kubo's done great work Ooh, on that. Wow. Leg. Yeah. You can see he's hesitant. He doesn't want to step in with it either. 
going to take away the power on him. And his left straight. Ooh, body shot. Ooh, big uppercuts. But uh, not landing clean for either for uh, both fighters there. Yep. This is mm -hmm. the third round. People are doing great work on the left. Yeah, he doesn't <laughs> want to get kicked there. Yeah, yeah. I'd Punch in the leg. Yeah. <laughs> Don't have to see that. No. Ooh, big front kick. Mm. Ooh. Yeah, he's he's worried about that lead leg. He's feeling it, man. Yeah. Yeah, he doesn't, doesn't even want to get nope. touched in nope. there. Kubo. Kubo is definitely aware of the damage he's done. No, he's still doing his low kicks now, but there's a minute left in the third round. Yep, not much time left. The damage is visible and apparent. I want to see Kubo just do a little more to Ooh, There you go, that's it. That was it. That was right it, yeah. On that's the same oh. spot. That's, that was it. And the angle on the kick is such, he's not chopping it up and down. No. He's bringing it up, you know, almost towards, on an angle, yeah. up toward Melsic's opposite shoulder. And what is, what is happening there is he's using the bone on his shin. He's making contact wow. completely with the bone on his wow. shin. And it's right in the meaty part, too. And it takes, landing that kick is very hard because mm. to, to pinpoint it takes yep. years and years of practice. Yeah, it's all right on the same spot. If you went back and watched the replay of this, you would just see every kick right on the same spot. Good head movement there, too, getting out of the way. That's something our coach is really good at. Mm. <laughs> yep, yep. <laughs> it's not sweet. That's right. Old school Japanese style. And the Japanese are just great low kicking. Huh? Nothing worse than fighting a good low kicking. Huh? I don't know. I mean, I guess they could give it to, to, to Kubo, but it's a title match. I think they're gonna make them make them both go the distance. Um, we'll see what happens here. Definitely did the damage, visible damage, um, especially from Milsic's reaction there. But just not. Uh, yeah, this is a title match. It's not a tournament, right? I don't want to see him break away a little bit more. Yeah. But, and Milsic, you know, had some had some big shots in there. Mm -hmm. Just nothing landing real clean. Nothing, nothing visibly rocking mm -hmm. Kubo. Kubo is really really bringing down his head mm -hmm. to, uh, to go with the, the momentum of uh, mm -hmm. six left, left punch. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's the experience showing yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 really just wanted a big knockout. Yeah. Uh, he kind of left his, left his game plan. Mm -hmm. um, Overcommitted, maybe? Yeah, yeah. 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 That, <laughs> that low kick. Mm. His leg is pro. Yeah, he's limping he's off the, the ring now. Yeah. Yeah. He's yeah. Yeah. real uncomfortable. Ah, Kuma, Kuma Yutares. Ah, sorry. Ah, thank you. 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 やっぱりあのこのボーノベルトを守るためにちょっと失敗試合してしまったんですけどごめんなさい大丈夫ですかいやあのもう相当いろいろプレッシャーがあって今回まあ初防衛ということでバザ出されやん強い選手なんでちょ
Really, yeah, even the man there saying it himself, not his most impress, impressive victory. Yeah, yeah. Uh, he was happy with the low kick win. But able to, able to use his experience and get the victory. Yeah. And the day, the job's done and you win. Yeah. So, so it's done done fair. fair. And clean. Yeah. Really the most important thing is to take the hardware home. Exactly. Well, there you have it. K1 World Grand Prix 2018 Japan K Festa 1 at the Saitama Super Arena Main Arena Configuration. See you next time.